price floors affect you? When our government creates policies, the policies have many, many effects, both on the macro and micro scale. The results of these policies are often positive, intentional effects. Sometimes, however, negative effects that overshadow the good intended also come from the policy. One policy in place that has unintended consequences is that of establishing a price floor of minimum wage. So what's a price floor? Well, a price floor is a government or institute set limit on how low a product can be priced. Price floors disturb the natural equilibrium of the demand and supply curve if they create a binding price floor. A binding price floor is one that is set above the equilibrium and therefore has a substantial effect on the curve. A great real world example of price floors is minimum wage. Minimum wage is a price floor that causes a decrease in labor demanded and an increase in labor supplied. This new amount can properly service the amount of labor supplied by common skill workers, resulting in a surplus in labor. When the minimum wage is increased, employers need to adjust their business model and often fire employees. Those employees who are lucky enough to stay on are now covering their own workload and that of those who were fired, therefore resulting in the remaining employees being overworked. Employers often look to technology to replace some of its employee pool. For example, many restaurants such as Panera and McDonald's are now installing computer stations that allow customers to order and pay for their meals without having to give their order to an employee behind a cash register. Employee wages are a major part of the U.S.'s economy. According to the International Trade Administration, service jobs accounted for more than 80% of U.S. private sector employment, or 89.7 million jobs. In 2014, according to the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics, about 3.9% or about 30 million workers of the American labor force were paid wages at or even below the federal minimum wage. Learning about price floors is an important lesson to understand as there are many real life examples such as minimum wage that have substantial effects on us. There is a balance between having too many unemployed laborers and having those employed earn enough in wages to pay for their cost of living. Increasing the minimum wage can have amazingly positive effects on those employees kept on the job. For those fired, though, minimum wage can bring on many hardships. The trick is to study the effects of the policies in depth in order to more accurately predict the effects of the policies and create a law that has the negative effects outweighed by the positive effects.